So I'm just going to um, summarize the uh, the weekend or the videos that you're going to see. Uh, I went to the Chatham and the London Casino. Uh, had a good time, and uh, that's what you're about to see. So again, today I'm off somewhere else, and uh, we'll uh, have more videos for that. So it's a day off today, and uh, I took a road trip, and it's Sunday. It was the uh, where we moved our clocks forward last night, so I'm glad I came here a little later because I'm tired. But the uh, road trip was good, it's nice and sunny out, and uh, we're going to start this, see what this is like today. Uh, stopped at a Timmy's and uh, whatever in uh, Wellington Road. Breakfast was good. All right. Okay, so I'm in London. I just left Costco, and uh, now I'm going to head to McDonald's and see what that's all about here. Interesting. Road trip happiness. Okay, we're gonna try this for the third time. Uh, it's Monday, a little after 11 o'clock in the morning. I'm gonna head to uh, Chatham. It is a day off for me, so I'm just gonna try and enjoy myself and um, go from there. We. Um, the one thing that uh, I wanted to say is that um, I'm going to go to Tim Hortons right now and I'm trying to give you some advice is that if you are going to win, if you want a coffee during roll-up, uh, what you've got to do, in my opinion, is um, keep all the rolls and keep paying for your coffee. So if you want a coffee in your roll-up, don't use it to buy a coffee until after the roll-up contest is finished. Because if you do, you don't get another roll. So basically you're screwing yourself. Um, so keep them all until after the um, roll-up the rim is um, finished. And uh, you will get a, um, a, you know, more rolls. So that's just my advice, and uh, go from there. Um, so that's all I can say, and um, I'll uh, I'll get back to you once I get into Chatham. So it was a uh, success at the casino. I walked out with uh, more money than I walked in with, which is a good thing. And right now I'm here at the Ford store in Chatham. And I'm just checking on things like this. If I'm gonna buy an electric vehicle or thinking about buying it, uh, I want to see that I can charge this thing if I'm in Chatham and uh, for free at any of these stores and this is uh, one of the dealerships that um, has a plug and they said to me yes at any time even if I don't buy a Ford uh, I guess the only one would be the Mustang um, they said, like, if I bought, like, say, the um, the E Soul, which is at the top of the list right now, um, I could plug it in. So I'm happy with that news, and 
Um, I'm going to leave it at that. So that's what I've learned. And it seems to be that it's going to be easier um, here in Chatham and in Windsor than, say, in London. So more research is needed. So it's the uh, Monday morning around uh, quarter after 10, uh, it's March the 22nd. I have a day off today and I'm on a little road trip on my way to uh, London. And uh, so I'm just, this is kind of like my first stop. Um, I get gas here. Reservation and uh, gas is about a dollar twenty a liter in Windsor, and it's usually quite a bit cheaper up here. So there it is, it's about a dollar seven. So that's good. I'm happy with that. So this is going to be our my first stop. Busy here today. So I'm leaving the uh, gas station, and um, gas wasn't a dollar seven; it was only a dollar two. So we're saving money. Anyways, I just thought I'd give you a report. Now I'm heading to the 401. Okay, so I'm here, and uh, let's just see how we do today. Tuesday, I believe it's March the 23rd, um, I got called into work, so off I go. Um, that's what we're doing today. And then uh, I'm going to edit a couple of videos that I took. So I'm off to work for a few hours and then I'll be back 